Don't let the world beat you up with a lie of how worthless you are when God's Word says the exact opposite. Top of the morning to you. When we read Ephesians chapter 1 with the eyes of love and a firm determination to get to know God better, we see a chapter that might as well be entitled, How Valuable We Are to God. Verse 3 tells us, God has blessed us in Christ with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly realm. Verse 4 tells us, He thought of us well before He created the world. His desire and plan for us was that we would be holy, set apart for Him, and blameless before Him in love. In fact, verse 5 says, He pre-planned to adopt us as His children through Jesus Christ, all the while giving us glorious grace. We are so valuable to Father God. In verse 7, He redeemed us by Jesus' blood, forgiving our sins thanks to His rich and gracious favor, which verse 8 says, He lavished upon us in every kind of wisdom and understanding. In verse 9, he even let us in on his overall plan described in verse 10. At the climax of the ages, he will unify all things and put them under Christ, both things in heaven and things on the earth. In addition to being close confidants, verse 11 tells us God gave us an inheritance. What is our appropriate response to these immense loving gestures by our Father? Verse 12, we want to live for the praise of his glory. Verse 13 tells us, God stamps us with the seal of the Holy Spirit. Verse 14, who is the guarantee of our inheritance. So what's possible for us as God's valued ones? Verse 17, we can get wisdom and revelation into the deep and intimate knowledge of God. Verse 18, the eyes of our heart can be flooded with light. So verse 19, we can know and understand the unlimited richness of God's power in and for us who believe through his through his strength verse 20 as was demonstrated when he raised christ from the dead and seated him at his right hand uh, to rule and have authority and dominion over everyone and everything not only in this age but in the age which is to come verse 22 he is also the supreme head of the church which verse 23 says is the body in fullness If you ever doubted your value here on earth, read this chapter over and over until it gets ingrained in you. Word of encouragement, when the world tells you a lie about your worth, smash it with God's truth. Like a little kid who gets hit by a bully, brushes home to a loving parent, God wants to hug us and tend to healing healing our wounds and reinforcing just how much he loves us in his word. We can sit and read it any time and as much as we want so that when we, we can laugh the next time we get bullied by the world because our God's love is never in doubt. Have a great day.